the immersion. It's real. I see an incantation for the upcoming battle. Battle against what? It's the battle against the military, of course. Who else are we going to fight? Uh, I don't know. Who is there to fight? Of course you don't. That's why I'm up here. Do you want to know how I know what we're going to fight? Here, look at this magic eight ball. I made it myself. <laughs> I don't see anything. That's because you're blind, doofus. Well, I can see that you're not wearing shoes. So who's the doofus now? Be gone, peasant. But you are right. I am not wearing shoes because they were stolen by the one percent. They are pink, sparkly, and they help me fly. So if you see them, give them to me. They are mine. So for now, I'm going to summon a dragon to devour anyone who's responsible for 87% of the water shortages. 9%, 15%, 94%, 48%, 72%, 83%, 32%, 56%, 100%. You're still just shouting percentages! Be gone, peasants! So, uh, those shoes are yours. No? Okay. I guess she keeps them. I mean... I suppose... Oh, bobbleheads. Want the next it is bobblehead? They only cost 500 union credits! Damn! Can we not save these people? Time grows short for all of us. <coughs> Please, my family is sick. Please, That's I'll take awesome. anything. <coughs> Spare some water. Ah, oh, that must be the theater. That's where I'm just trying to go. One credit, please. Just one. Um. <coughs> yes, I'm assuming you're the one I have to Take talk it, to. Please. Take it. Thank you. You're welcome. Enjoy the show. Will do. Ooh. Am I? Dear, oh dear. Lots of people here. Ooh. On, on the bottom floor? Why am I on the bottom? I want to be at the top. I mean, especially if you're trying to kill somebody who's on the stage, it'd be, be, it'd be most effective to be on the top. Oh man. Oh wow. Uh, there's people here all of a sudden. They just weren't here a moment ago. I suppose it does have to use a system where it removes them and brings them back every so often because there's just no way any computer could handle it if every single character was always you fell from the sky friend are you okay <laughs> how are you doing uh, oh, 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 oh dear. <laughs> Lots of uh, skins that couldn't be found. That's, uh, yeah. I want to see all the rest of the peoples. I'll go to the sparklies in a minute. Just want to see the atops. Move along. I am, I am, I am. All the way over there, and I'm all the way over here. Guess I can. Um, is it worth the health? No, I will not leap. I want to just leap, but <laughs> I don't. 
don't have that much health. <laughs> or that much food. Yeah. Desperate times. <laughs> Gotta take the stairs. <laughs> You know, times are getting desperate when you gotta take the stairs. Indeed. Indeed, indeed. No funny business. Um, piss off. <laughs> this content here that I'm creating is probably not very entertaining at all, but, you know, <laughs> I'm not expecting anybody to be watching anyways. Oh, y y you look like you... <laughs> that person's got problems. <laughs> uh Anyways, let's actually get back to the story, shall we? Yes. Oh. Wait a second. Hold up a second. <laughs> Fancy meeting you here! <laughs> Ah, uh, yes. They seem ever so slightly taller. Ah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Dear me. Uh, Dear me! How are, how are you doing? <laughs> how are you doing, me? Ah. Uh. <laughs> I'll go take my seat. Hey, that's my that, that was my seat over there, though. Oh, well. I'll sit here instead, because... story. Welcome, everyone. As you know, our world is a dark place, full of misery, suffering, and death. But out of the darkness, comes a light, a light that gives us hope, and it comes in the form of this show. Exodus is the gateway to a better world. I'm not saying this to gain viewers, but simply because it's true. Over the past four years, I have worked closely with the government on a project that will transform our home. Tonight, the public will lay eyes upon it for the first time. And to the season three, Genesis. This is actually quite <laughs> impressive. Thank you. Thank you. It feels great to finally reach this point. The point that all the sacrifices we've made were not in vain. After the attacks on the Temerity last year, nearly 200 died trying to make Exodus a reality. Among them was my sister-in-law, Captain Hollis Monroe. Years ago, when my own sister died, I was there for Hollis, and she was there for me. My sister's death shook us both to our very core. And now that Hollis is also gone, I must now continue what they believed in. A world that can be healthy and green again. In remembrance of the crew and our beloved captain, I have asked her younger brother, Lieutenant Ryan Monroe, to join us today. Ryan? Thank you, sir. My sister, served our great country with all of her being. She believed that one day the world could be... Well, Ryan, I'm going to have to cut you short, or the recording software will. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the immersion, it is real. It is so real. <laughs> uh... 